Hi everyone. In the last class, in last classes, we have completed the packing efficiency in different. That means in FCC, BCC, or in the simple unit cells. So, <clears throat> and what the conclusion we draw from that is, as the packing efficiency increases, the definitely the stability goes on increases. Approximately in single. We saw fifty two point four percent. It is packed, right? And in BCC, nearly sixty four percent. What is the difference? FCC, HCP, or in CCP, what we saw is sorry sixty eight, and this is sixty four. That means in FCC. Or else, <clears throat> to this FCC, what we can call HCP or CCP. In 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 this, we see uh, it is more packed as compared to simple as well as the BCC. And in simple word, what we can say is, as the packing efficiency percent increases, the stability that means that solid will be more and more stable. And this is uh, as I said in the last class itself. This <clears throat> part is again very important for your competitive examinations, right? So. <clears throat> After completing this very important part of the solid state, so today just we will see what are the lattice points and how to calculate the lattice points. So lattice points is nothing but it is a point that means lattice points are the points lattice or lattice you can pronounce it as per your convenient lattice points. So here. <clears throat> what we saw in case of solid is nothing but there is a cube. In cube we have corners, we have faces as well as center, right? So <clears throat> the point where the atom is present is nothing but let us find. Very simple. See. Here, in 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 these three uh, different type of unit cells, our constituent particles or the atoms are present at various positions or at various points. Like uh, some of the atoms may present as a corner, or in in other case, what we saw corner as well as in uh, at uh, I mean exactly at the center, and in in other case, <clears throat> what we learned is. Um, there may be presence of these atom at the faces. I mean, at the wall, wall of the uh, what unit cell. So these are the possible possibility where we can find the uh, constituent particles in a different unit cells. So likewise, if they are present only at the corner, then what we said, those type of unit cells are called as simple unit cell. This part, uh, the, the, this part is very easy. But I am just reminding you. Only if they are present, I mean the atom or the constituent particles are situated only at the corners, then such unit cells are called as simple unit cell. If they are not only present at the corner, even if in some case if the constituent particle is present at the center of a unit cell, then such unit cells we uh, call uh, them as a Centered unit cell, like in centered unit cell, what we call that <coughs> this type of unit cell is nothing but BCC. That means corner plus one atom at the center. And likewise, in case of AFCC, what we saw is not only the uh, uh, I mean uh, constituent particles are present at the corner. They are all they they are also may may be present or may be situated at the center of the faces. So that's why uh, if they if corner as well as the atoms are present at the face, then definitely those type of unit cells are called as FCC type of unit cell. Why I am reminding these uh, uh, this point is nothing but these points are very important. And somebody has asked of what are various Lattices. So let me mm, uh, explain that. Uh, see here, uh, we have a, a different type of. If you see the NCERT book, 
right i am not going with the uh, syllabus uh, like uh, in in case of offline classes like uh, how we will go but i am just uh, pointing out uh, the very important part from this chapter i am not going in detail right so bravias letters are nothing but there are seven different cells we can see rhombic orthorhombic cubic right so those seven uh, unit cells are nothing but uh, nothing but the bravias lattices right you can uh, if they ask you for uh, explain i mean what are bravias lattices are nothing but the seven different uh, cells are called as what bravias lattices if if they want you to uh, if they ask you to Uh, uh, give any example, then you can give among those seven. You can give any one example. So that is also very simple type of question, right? So <clears throat> now uh, coming to the nice point, where I mean the point where the atom present. I mean it is a point where the atom is present is nothing but the nice point, right? See, so what I said, atom may be present at the corner, atom may be present at the center. atom may be present at the faces and one more if you want uh, the atom may be present at the end uh, i mean end centered unit cell likewise so i don't want to disturb you now when you come to the offline class definitely i will explain about that and uh, and i have already explained the these concepts during offline classes right so okay let it be uh, uh, now we will come again to the lattice point here the point where the atoms are present is nothing but lattice points lattice points see where the atoms are present that means constituent particle the constituent particle may be present at the corner or or they may be present at corner plus uh, body center or they may be present at the corner as well as at the faces then <clears throat> the next question is what is the main uh, uh, point here we need to remember right so see constituent particle and the lattice point is nothing but same one thing you clear right one thing you clear yourself that the uh, i mean constituent particle and the lattice point is nothing but same the const where the constituent particle is present in the unit cell that point is nothing but lattice point right is it clear okay now so where the atom is present in the unit cell that particular point or that particular side is nothing but lattice point that means now what we can say is lattice points are nothing but the constituent particle they may be present at the corner may be present at the center or they may be present at the center of a face right so now <clears throat> what they ask is if they ask you to find out the number of lattice point present in simple unit cell then what we need to do right so this is the question and and before starting this don't get confused the number of atoms are different than number of lattice points we have calculated the number of atoms based on their contribution don't forget dear students right so otherwise it will be very uh, confusing one right so i repeat the number of atoms and that that part is very important for two marks i have already uh, said to you that that part, part is very important and uh, uh, in that part we can expect a two marks uh, from that right to calculate the number of atoms so number of atoms we have calculated based on the contribution right and now this case is totally different we are just counting the constituent particle right lattice point is nothing but what i said the constituent particle if they ask you to find out <coughs> the number of lattice point present in see the question will be like this calculate the number of lattice point let us points present in simple unit cell this question has not been asked at but 
if it ha if it has given in the uh, uh, syllabus means we have to uh, uh, say that this is also a link right so <clears throat> check out the question once again calculate the number of lattice points present in the simple unit cell that means what what he is asking is nothing but calculate the number of lattice point present in the the simple in in case of simple unit cell so dear students here it is very easy so now see solution or answer you can say so you just draw the simple unit cell simple means one right simple is nothing but the constituent particles are only present at right corners only so that is nothing but the what simple unit cell so what he is asking calculate the number of lattice points present in the simple what i said the constituent particles are nothing but the lattice points or the <coughs> lattice point is nothing but the the atom where the atom are present is nothing but lattice point so that means i need to calculate all the i mean i need to count all the constituent particle that means simple is nothing but what the constituent particles are only present at the corner so that means how many corners are there there are eight corners that means how many lattice point simple so therefore in simple number of lattice points is equal to how much 1 to 4 upside and down 4 down that means 4 plus 4 8 lattice point right so very simple very simply one we can calculate the number of lattice point that means <clears throat> the constituent particle or the atoms are nothing but the lattice points we have to go again with the definition simple is nothing but only at the corner that means the constituent particles are only present at the corner and what i said lattice point is nothing but number of constituent particles here the constituent particles are present at the corner and how many corners are there eight corners so that's why the lattice point will be eight right so now coming to number two that means in case of bcc BCC type of unit cell. It is very simple. I will go uh, directly with this diagram only. See, BCC is nothing but one, right? We have to remember this. BCC is nothing but the constituent particles not only present at the corner, the one particle that means the one constituent particle may be present at where at this exactly at the center of a unit cell. So now count the number of constituent particles that is nothing but the lattice points so 8 that means we are in bcc therefore in bcc now 8 and one more extra has came why because it is a bcc type of unit cell so thus 8 plus 1 how much 9 constituent particles are present in case of bcc type of unit cell so this is in case of BCC and coming to last one that is FCC in case of FCC now you can count so you just remove this and you say FCC FCC means see uh, we have to define it FCC is nothing but corner as well as at the faces so that means how many corner eight corner we already know faces are six right so say this as a front and this as a back let me see now you just count eight plus six right eight plus six how much 14 lattice points are present in case of what in case of fcc type of unit so, so this is uh, all about uh, how to calculate the lattice points it is not a very important part i can say but uh, it is already given in our syllabus so that means we have we need to know what are lattice points right so you just go through once again uh, by uh, seeing this video repeatedly and then 
you know, make a notes who are uh, uh, I mean freshers, I mean newcomers. You can make a notes by uh, uh, seeing these videos repeatedly, right? So this is all about today's class to your students. In the next class, uh, we will be uh, uh, solving some problems on density, and that part, part as I said in the offline classes, and we have uh, solved many. Uh, I mean, nearly eight to ten problems, I think. Uh, or 5 to uh, 8, I don't know exactly the number, but still we will uh, solve some exam problems uh, during, the, uh, during tomorrow's class. So, um, <clears throat> I mean, that part is also very important for you. Uh, that means it depends on the sector, the density problem. Sometimes it has been asked for two months, for two months, and some sometime, and very rarely. Uh, it has asked for three months. So let us see what happens. But in the during uh, during next class, definitely we will be solving some density problems. Right? Thank you.